Do you think that there is too much hawkish talk right now and too much hawkish projections at a time when it seems like the Fed is saying we still haven't done enough, we want to get to 2% a little bit sooner, even as we acknowledge this is going to be a battle? Yeah, I think if you were to take the SEP and the statement on face, fully on face value, this would be an overly hawkish policy stand for this economy. Um, among the other things, the fact that we are now at one cut means that given that the Fed will not want the stop, go, stop, go um, cycle, that means that cut comes late in the year, very late in the year. And I agree with Diane, it does matter when you start the cutting cycle. It really does matter. It matters for small businesses. It matters for low-income households. And it matters for the economy. So if you were to take this at face value, then this the market would be selling off right now. But it's not for good reason. And that's what I, I said earlier. Um, and Bob mentioned it as well, is I don't think this fully reflects the latest set of data. And given that this is data de de dependent Fed, if this had if the data had happened yesterday or the day before, the S&P would look very different. 